What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to sign into your eFootball account and fix any login problems you might be facing. The first thing you need to check when facing login issues is your internet connection. A stable connection is necessary for logging into your eFootball account. To make sure your internet is working properly, you can run a quick speed test using websites like speedtest.net. Just head over to the site or use the app and check if your connection speed is sufficient. A slow or unstable network connection can prevent the app from connecting to the servers. So if you see issues with your internet connection, try restarting your router or switching to a more stable connection. If your internet is working fine, the next step is to ensure that your eFootball app is up to date. Sometimes the app might have corrupted cache or outdated data, which could be causing login issues. An update can often fix these problems. To update the app, open up your Google Play or App Store. Tap on your profile icon in the upper right corner. Scroll down to see if there's an update available for eFootball. If there is, tap update next to the game. Once the update is complete, try logging in again to see if the issue is resolved. If updating the app doesn't solve the problem, it could be a temporary bug on your device itself. In this case, a simple restart on your iPhone might fix it. To restart your device, swipe down from the top right corner to open a control center. Press and hold the power button until you see the drag to power off slider. Slide it to the right to turn off your device. After your iPhone powers off, press and hold the power button again until the Apple logo appears and your phone powers back on. Once your phone has restarted, open the eFootball app and see if the login issue has been resolved. If you're still having trouble logging in, the next step is to reinstall the app. This will clear any corrupted data that might be preventing the app from functioning correctly. To uninstall the eFootball app, Find the app on your home screen. Press and hold the icon until you see a menu pop up. Tap Remove App and then select Delete App to uninstall it completely. After it's removed, head back to the App Store, search for eFootball and reinstall the game. A fresh install will often resolve issues caused by corrupted app data. If none of these methods work, the problem could be related to your account itself. It's possible that Konami has flagged your account for some reason. And the best way to resolve this is to contact their customer support. To do this, navigate to the Konami customer support page linked in the video description and select eFootball. You'll need to fill out a few details such as your country, Konami ID and your specific issue or question. Be sure to include your email address so that they can get back to you. Once you've filled everything in, click Next and follow the prompts to submit your request to Konami's support team. They will help you get your account back if there's an issue on their end. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.